Welcome back to another video. It is after game seven, so we'll go ahead and just kind of move you out of the way. Disappointing. Disappointing. Quite disappointing right now, but... God, the Leafs are going to be making some moves in the offseason. I can't imagine Gardner still has a job, and I think Marlowe's probably done. And I think uh, probably their coaching staff is probably going to be looking for work. But uh, we'll see. So trying to get myself back into a better mood. I'm going to open up some 15-16 champs. Never opened up this. I've had this box for a while. Just kind of saving it for the right moment, I believe. Now... Is the time. Oh, what a brutal end to the season. They have two chances. The Leafs. The Leafs have two chances to win. Couldn't finish it. So, yeah. Got some Gretzky stuff in the back. And uh, my exclusive young gun, McKinnon. I don't know. I don't know who to cheer for now. I guess I'd like to see uh, St. Louis. You know, no Canadian teams. Calgary, gone. <sighs> Jets, gone. Leafs, gone. Montreal, never in it. Ottawa, woof. These are Bent, Ginla, uh, Mark Shifley. Now, I don't know what they call these. I uh, guess it's it's a parallel. Jack Johnson. It's, uh, I've seen people open this up before. It has a, it's cardboard, so it's very old school, like a, an OPG or a Tops. But I mean, you can get... I think you'd get autos. Uh, Nazim, speaking of which, this is not an auto, but it is a relic of Jonathan Bernier. It's kind of weird, um, at least Stefaniak and Nugent. It's weird to see a cardboard card like this, not um, the usual material. I know it's all cardboard, but, you know, brown cardboard to have a, a jersey piece in it, but. Here we go. Uh, oh, I get three hits per box. So that's one of my memorabilia hits. And then there's one hard signed auto. So. What the hell is this? Henry Hudson. Oh, there's a Brendan Gauntz rookie and Emile Poirier rookie. Hope I didn't miss any rookies. Uh, oh, I did. Shane Prince. There we go. All right, so this is Henry Hudson. Uh, bu -bu -bu he discovered the Hudson River. Good for you. I wonder what's going to happen to Kadri. That's uh, my question, too. I mean, there's there's lots of questions that uh, that need to be answered. So this is the other kind of cool thing. This is Percy Rock or Purse Rock, Northern Wonders. So the um, the cards that you can get from Canadian Tire, which I thought of picking up, but in the end I did not, um, are similar to this, I guess. You, know, you can get cool, weird things in that. Uh, the map cards are kind of cool. Freddie Anderson. Oh, there we go. Hard sign. Jakub Voracek. Hard signed. Auto. Hey, he's a good, decent player. And this is a smallmouth bass. Derek Forbert and Evander Kane. Well, there's two hits. Be nice to get something. Just give me something. Give me, oh, Mike Richter. Uh, get me back into it. Good mood. Uh, Antoine Bebo, Leaf rookie, no longer with the Leafs. I'm 
I'm still just kind of, kind of in a daze. Ablocator, gold. This is Traditions, Playoff Handshake. Yeah, it's kind of a nice, neat card, I guess. I, oh, I guess it's an insert, too, but whatever. Curtis Lazar. Like, how do you have two chances? Two chances. Two chances. <sighs> one at home, one on the road. And man, oh man, talk about <laughs> pulling your goalie. Kevin Fiala. I've got a lot of Kevin Fiala cards. Matt Pumple. I have a lot of Matt Pumple, too. Um, how do you pull your goalie and suck so bad? It's like video game crap. Pulling your goalie and you just never even have the puck. Unbelievable. What a... Uh, oh, that's nice. Bobby Orr. My uncle is a big Bobby Orr guy. I'll keep that one to the side. Give that to him. Brock McGinn, rookie. You know, I'd love to get a... I'm getting lots of rookies here, but I'm not getting anything. Oh, no. Give me a McDavid. Kalen Kyle. That is Max Domi. Oh, look at that. All right. Nice. I can take that. Max Domi relic. Rookie relic. Cool. Good. That's good. That's great. That was a... All base pack, I guess. These ones look a little bit different. All base. Hey, you pull the goalie and you don't even have the puck. Like, what are you doing? Tom Myers, Devin Shore, gold rookie, a fish, a burbot fish. George Vancouver, uh, Hunter Shinkaruk. I got a lot of Hunter Shinkaruk too. Oh my God! Tico Teravine and Gold, Dustin Brown, Jeff Carter. I mean, you pull your goalie, you can't even get it deep. And Gardner, oh, don't get me started with Gardner. Oh. Yeah, that's, he is, uh, they call Justin Williams Mr. Game 7. Oh, so what does that make Gardner? Game 7 is a minus 10. It's like the opposite. I mean, you're better off just going short-handed. Northern Pike, Jacob Delarose, rookie. Come on. Minus 10. Marlowe. I don't know what he was doing. Maybe they should have... Oh, look at that. A bonus. Matt Pumple. Rookie Relic. Hmm. Alright, got a freebie. Uh, Marlowe. I mean, yeah, great. You're playing, you know, six or whatever hundred games in a row. Robbie Fabry rookie. But what good is it? Shukum Jin Mason. Gold. That's kind of nice. I'll keep that one to the side. Rookie of Ryan Hartman. Um, what good are you? Yeah, okay, you play X amount of games in a row, but if you can't keep up in the playoffs and you're not producing offensively, then what was the point? So I think he's getting shipped off to Robodaw Island. This is a bowfin fish. And last one here. Unbelievable. Just garbage. Just miserable. Oh, I got a silver. And it is of Andrew Shaw. I don't think these are numbered. Oh, no, never mind. It is. Hold on. And Henrik Samuelson. So, let's see if this will zoom in. Of course not. Why would it? Oh, there we go. I think I got it.
Anyway, it says 12 of 25, Andrew Shaw. I wish it was someone else. But uh, 12 of 25, it's kind of nice, the print they have on there. So, we had a bonus. You're supposed to grab three hits, and I got four, maybe five if you count the shot. Matt Pumple, Rookie Relic. I actually like these um, Rookie Relic cards. I might look into getting some more. Uh, Max Domi, so that's a nice one. And Jonathan Bernier, just the Relic, which would be great if he, he was still a Leaf, or if it was Freddie Anderson. And then my hard sign was... Jakub Voracek, and we got a 12 of 25 Andrew Shaw. If anyone's an Andrew Shaw fan, you let me know. You can pretty much take it. And Shookum Jim Mason. And then you get a bunch of rookies and gold parallels. So uh, if I can find another box of this for the same price that I got this one, I would, um, yeah, I'd pick up another one. It's nice. I mean, it's, uh, I'd rather have this than OPG, that's for sure. Anyway, I'm going to go lick my wounds. Maybe I'll open up another box. I've got some other stuff here. But I uh, thought maybe I'd feel a little bit better opening up some cards, opening up some packs. But I do not. Um, so stay tuned for more videos. Uh, I'll have some more stuff coming up. we got the card show coming up in one and a half weeks. May 3rd in Toronto, I will be there. Not signing autographs, unless you happen to see me and you actually want one, then sure, why not? But uh, I will be there, and I will be picking up some things to, uh, you know, add to the channel, add to the collection. Um, oh, before I go, you, if you don't care, you can always just, you know, tune out now. Uh, previous video I mentioned I would explain how I got this Matthews. I'll make it really quick. I had a um, Walmart blaster box. Not the small one, but the, the one where you get a bonus Parkhurst pack. Um, got it from Walmart, brought it home. You know, I think the Leafs lost that night, so it was a Friday. I thought, okay, I'll open it up. I open it up. First thing I notice, there's an extra sheet of wrap on the outside of the box. Kind of odd. First pack I open up is the Parkhurst. It contains three base cards. Open up another pack, nothing in it, except for base. And then I started looking at the packs, and they all look tampered with. Uh, I have all the packs still. I stopped opening after two packs, I think, um, and haven't done anything with it yet. So now I'm pretty bummed because it's like a $50 box. I was hoping for a Matthews. So to try to make myself feel a little bit better, I decided to open up a tin that I had uh, that I had had sitting around for a while. First pack I open up, just a canvas card. Second pack I open up, Austin Matthews, game changer. So, you know, I had one box that was tampered with, the tin was pristine, and uh, I finally got the Matthews. So, they always say that, uh, you know, karma is uh, can be a bitch. Um, I guess... Uh, I guess karma has nothing to do with it. What Everything, I think, is just I got lucky. You know, uh, bad, bad experience with tampered product. And uh, sure enough, the, the hockey card gods paid it forward. So that's how I got the Matthews. Uh, unfortunately, they are no longer in the playoffs. So you can go back there. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed my stories. Thank you for listening to me rant and rave. And I really, really wish the Leafs were still in it. Uh, good news though all the leaf cards next week at the uh, the hockey show probably just went down 25% because that's what I'll be saying they're not even in the playoffs anymore how are you going to charge that much so happy buying for uh, any leaf fans next week alrighty that's enough stay tuned for some more stuff hope you enjoyed this 2015-16 champs box um, and we'll uh, take care Go Blues go, or Columbus maybe? Yeah, yeah. let's go for uh, Columbus in the east and uh, Blues in the west. See ya.